Yo, welcome back to the channel. So, I'm in Port Bergy, I think it's called. I'm not too sure of the name, but I'll put it on the video. But it must be the only place in Madagascar that hasn't actually got a port. Which is um, strange. I don't know why it's called Port, but there you go. It's quite a big um, town or city, maybe. I don't think it's a city, but a big town in Madagascar. I don't know what what business they do here but well, they got money in this this town there's business going on there's money to be made but I don't know a lot about it I've drove through it a couple of times well, I'll, I'll have a little drive and we can go and have a look see what we can see on the way I know that the road's pretty pretty bad further up about one kilometer further down the road it's a bad road So we'll have a look, see what we can see in it. See if we can get the, the, the name of this place properly. B E R G E, it is. Port. Port Berg. <laughs> I'm dyslexic. No point me trying to. I'm spelling the letters out and then I'm going to try and pronounce, pronounce them. That's no good for me, that like, you're, you, you've got a lot of better chance than me of getting that name right. Port Bergy, Bergy, Bergy. Yeah, a lot of construction going on. I think it's about 11.30, so the schools are just, just kicking out. Lunchtime. The office staff are just on the way to going home for the lunches. So there's a bit of movement around the town. Looks like a good place to me, like, I mean, I've literally drove through this place three times in my whole life. This is my third time, but it looks quite appealing. I think it's quite old as well, like, but there can't be a port because it's in the middle of nowhere, like it's in the middle of inland, you know what I mean? It's, it's not on the coast. So I don't know why it's called Port Bergy. Port Berg, is it? Port Berg? Big water tower there, like just on the right. What is this guy doing here? Minister Finances, Minister of Finances. Not many towns have got a Minister of Finance. Five hundred and eighty seven kilometers away from Tananarivu, from the capital north, heading towards OTP, Diego Suarez. Port Berg, I reckon it is. A load of mace growing there on the right. too far away from home but the road's gonna be bad and it's gonna be slow so it could take a little while what's this guy doing what a twat what a twat excuse my language I don't know why he had to take my side of the road up there like when he could see I was coming towards him Maybe small in person, but my car's massive. So I don't know why you can't see that. You have a rule in Madagascar. The bigger your vehicle, the more right you've got to the road. 
and they, you can just push people out of the way. So like a push bike has got no rights apart from they can push it, push a human out of the way. One of these tuk-tuks in front of us, they can push a motorbike out of the way. And a, a lorry is king of the road, he can push everybody out of the way. Strange system, but it seems to work. I think we're gonna hit this bit of bad road in a second. Where it's just basically the road's just gone. Our tractor! Full of sand for building, probably. Maybe, maybe for building. Looks a bit red for building, but maybe. We do use red, red sand for building. Yeah, it looks like mainly a farming community, but there's obviously more to it in this, this town because they've got stuff going on. They've got nice vehicles, they've got nice nice clothes, they've got... They seem to be doing all right. Get out of the way, dog. Yeah, obviously there's farming going on. They've got farm fields all over the place. It looks like an interesting place to um, stop for, for a, a night maybe and have a look round if you're a tourist and that. If I ever get a chance I will do myself. I'm always too busy picking my nose or doing something. Just don't have the time. Bon voyage! Miss Outra, merci beaucoup. Thank you very much. Out of Port Burrish or Port whatever it is. And this must be where the road gets bad unless they fixed it since the last time I came through. I seriously doubt it, this road's not that new. I'm sure it was here. It's gonna be here, innit? Here it is, here it is. Where the road just completely vanished. Gendarmerie's too slow for me there, like too slow. Stuck his head out. But I was just too fast for him. Nope, this isn't the bit of road either. They must have fixed it. That's good. Or have I spoke too soon? Nice and green and lush, the north light. I mean, the south's a bit green at the moment, but only because it's had a lot of rain. But the last few years, it didn't have any rain in the south. And it was dry. It was like a desert down there. Everything was dead and just on fire and stuff. You'd see fires all over the hills and stuff where the sun was just lighting up the dry grass. Whereas now it's a bit bit, bit green, but here, oh, it's green all the time, like, nice and green. Is the bus not gonna move out of your way? Nope. This is um, one of the taxi buses, probably from Tanner. Yeah, it's from Tanner, that. Oh, in Manjunga. Nice place, Manjunga. If you're gonna, if you fancy um, coming to Madagascar, if, if you've got like only two weeks or something, I'd recommend going, flying into Tanner, and then just get a taxi bus, or um, if you can afford it, get a, a private driver and Land Cruiser to take you direct to Manjunga for two weeks. It's a nice, nice city. It's all right. It's got, it's got quite a lot of attractions and things to do. It's all right. If you've got a bit more time. You could um, see, see Manjunga, Diego, or if you've got even more time, you could see Nosy B as well. And um, they're all in the north, all three of them places. If you're going to come for three months, maybe go to um, go, go south, check out the south for three months. Nice. Uh, go Tulia, Mangili, places like that. Fucking hell, that was a big bump. So, there you go. I'll leave that video here. They fix the road. Happy days. I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Give us a like, give us a sub. Bye bye. And if you know the right pronunciation of that city, that town, well done you. I ain't got a clue.